there's um three songs specifically that I really want to listen to and like watch the music video for. So one of them is pretty sure it's an elite 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 magnetic because I have heard I have heard the song already. Of course I have. You know, it's everywhere, honestly. Um but I haven't seen the music video, so I really wanna watch I really wanna watch it. Shush, please. I really wanna watch and just see see the girlies because I don't I don't know them. I haven't met them, so I wanna meet them. So let's go. Zero sugar hydration. I'm just trying to play cool. But I just can hide that. I'm I love that part. <laughs> so Setting. This time I want to like it's me be lift summer moon summer moon oh new jeans new jeans has a new has a new one has bubblegum wait do they have any more songs really you say their name someone help me <laughs> I'm so sorry, I'm butchering it. Do they, do they, do they have more songs? Oh, they do. Oh, they have a whole album. A little EP. Oh, well, share, share, how many songs? So there's four, including Magnetic. So, I mean, might as well, you know? That's the point of this video. <laughs> So the album's called Super Roomy. Mm -hmm. 
that I just stopped <laughs> crocheting. <laughs> mm. Mm, I really like their sound so far. Okay, I'm going to skip magnetic just because we already have that one. Midnight Fiction. This is speaking to my reader heart. For real. That's really oh look at girl syndrome. <laughs> really liking their their tone and their voice um 
I think I, I really like My World and Magnetic. I think those two will probably be my top ones from the EP. I'm really excited to see what they come out with in the future because I mean they they've been blowing up with Magnetic. Uh, you hear that song everywhere. And all the reels and all the TikTok shorts, all that. Um, and they have a really, really fun, like, almost like bubblegum-esque kind of uh, tone vibe to their music. So I'm really interested to see what else they come out with. Uh, yeah, so that was, that was really fun. Glad I got to uh, listen to more of them. I want to actually look them up really quickly and just see, just like know their names. I'm not going to recognize who's who right away, but you know, let's see. Right, so there's no. There's Minju. There's Mocha. Oh, she's Japanese. Hmm, she's Japanese. Okay. So we got two Koreans, one Japanese member, Roni. Mm -hmm. And then. Ew. Okay, so we have two two Japanese members and three Korean. Oh my gosh, she's Aquarius. She's an Aquarius like me, and she's INFJ too. Ooh. Oh, I think I I have heard people talk about her. Wait, how old are they? 2008, 2007, 2004, 2004. Oh yeah, they're so they're so really young. I have no idea what age that is. Oh God. I, I don't know. After the 2000s, I don't know. 2004 minus 20. Oh, okay. 20. 20 and who's the youngest? 2008, I think. Six, so the youngest is 16, I think. Yeah, so the youngest is 16, the oldest is 20. Okay. Um... I think they're definitely older than New Jeans or when they debuted. Uh, but they're still, still really young. But yeah, that's just fun. This is interesting. I love, I love that we're getting a lot more girl groups. Um, cause I don't know. I feel like, I feel, I feel like we needed that. I feel like we need more girl groups. So yeah, so this is exciting. Exciting stuff's happening. Okay, now I want to stop yawning for once. Jesus. Okay, now I kind of want to watch New Jeans. Speaking of of girl groups, should we watch New Jeans Bubblegum now? It came out 12 or 13 hours ago now. Ready to switch? Break up with wipes. Garnier Micellar Cleansing Water. Micelles cleanse like a magnet. Now I Oh my god, her curly hair. Oh, she looks so pretty. Oh, they're doing, they're doing that, like, um, little keychain, old school keychain. Oh, I love the, like, early 2000 vibes so far. Oh, yeah. 
her hair is so interesting. <laughs> is that her, actually her hair or is that a wig? I love her curly hair. I don't, I don't have them. I can't identify each member. I know most of their names though. But I love the curly hair. Isn't that like Danielle? Or... the vibes of their music videos. Their music videos are always so like nostalgic and there's also like I feel like there's always like an undertone of like bittersweetness to it. I don't know why. It's like a POV. <laughs> my little POV moment. Oh my god, that was so fun. That was so fun and cute. Oh my god, Zico has a song with Jenny. Hmm, interesting. But anyway, but oh, that was so cute. Like, like I said, or like I was saying, I love the the vibes of their music videos so much. Like it's always got that like retro old school kind of like 90s 2000s feel to them and it just always makes me feel so nostalgic and and also like like I don't know why but I always feel like there's like an undertone of like melancholy and like bittersweetness to it even, even when the song itself is so like poppy and and upbeat like like with um Oh, oh my god, is that what it's called? Is that the title of it? Oh my god. Um, like that video was... It had some, it had some dark, dark undertones a little bit, you know? And that was really fun. Okay, so let's see who else... Okay, so I mentioned I wanted to watch Solar, or listen to Solar's song, and also Boy Next Door. So, but then there's also the Zico song with Jenny. What is it? I really wanna really wanna check out Boy Next Door though. Because I really like the like few music videos that I've seen from them and the song that I've heard from them. I really like them. So it's their Earth, Wind and Fire. Let's go. 
not that move. <laughs> I think that that's that. We did a little that that. Oh. Whoa, 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 what? <laughs> oh, that's the leader. Great, so that was Boy Next Door, and that song was really, really fun. Also, the, the music video was really, really fun as well. It was really silly and goofy, which I love. I feel like these boys are pretty silly and goofy themselves from like the few clips that I've seen. I also did recognize the leader, and he's really like the only member that I know. I know his name is Jaehyun. Jaehyun? Don't know if I'm saying it right, but I know it's good. Thank <laughs> Um, but yeah, he's a, he's so he's so adorable. Honestly, I have a soft spot for him. Ever since that one clip I saw of him when I think he was like emceeing, and he got like spooked by the confetti from the show, and he just like, he just looks so little and like oh, he's just so cute. Um, but yeah, but they're they're I feel like their music videos are always like. Just really fun, really outlandish. Cause even like their, I think their view song, and their like debut title track was really, was really fun, too. And yeah, so that really like Boy Next Door. Really, you should really check out more of their their songs. I feel like they have a really fun interesting it's very different it's very different from the other from all the other boy groups also i really like how each even though all of these all of these groups are under hype i like that you know the ones that are in like the different little like sub labels i like that they all have like their own voice their own like tone like I feel like off off the bat like you can't tell that they're from Haim right because like they're because even though they're on like they're on like in the little individual labels are all under the big umbrella of Haim right so I really like that because like even with um um new jeans and elite <laughs> Like, um, you know, they're both, they're both girl groups, they're both pretty, pretty recent type girl groups. Um, and both of those groups have really young members, but they're all, they're both very different. They both stand 
on their own. And I really like that. And I'm sure, like, you know, they're working with different kind of producers and different writers and stuff. So that probably is also a big factor in as well. But e even so, like, oh, I just just love, love music, love listening to new music. So that was really fun, Boy Next Door. Okay, so now, now let's check out Miss Solar. I don't actually know what the song is called. Mm, let me see. Is it called Glam? I'm not actually sure if it has a music video. It might not. No, it is. I'm sick. I'm hot. I'm gorgeous. So bad. I want a black and white wine and pink. I want a black and white wine and pink. This is the song. I want a black. This is the song. Pink. I want a black and white wine and pink. Doesn't matter. But it doesn't it doesn't look like it has It doesn't look like it, it has a music video though. Right? Dang, I really wanted to have a music video. It gives such queer energy, which is like a big reason why I really wanted to listen to it. And I was hoping it had a music video, but it doesn't it doesn't seem like there is. Is it out? Is it even out? Is it not out? Stop it. Is it not out yet? What is it going on? No, it's out. Oh no, it's not out. April 30. Oh no. <laughs> Maybe that's why. No, I'm really, oh, okay, now I'm really excited to listen to that then. Okay, 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 okay. Okay, so then, okay, so, since we can't listen or watch it, let's watch Zico with Jenny. Hot spot. I think Zico is um boy next door's papa. <laughs> right? Or is it um a different girl? Yeah. 
at the end. <laughs> I liked it. Wow, I didn't think I was actually going to like it as much. Ah, okay, that was fun. I really liked the, the beat in the background. Like, that was really, oh, that was so cool. It was very, like, street style, I feel like. Um, wow, I really, really like it. I like Jenny's. I like Jenny's um, uh, collab or like all of her verses and all of her parts and stuff. That was fun. I like. I should check out Zico more, as well. I'm not sure if I've if I've heard any of his other songs. But yeah, I really need to. And I'm pretty. I'm pretty sure. I almost just smacked myself with that. Oh my god. <laughs> I'm pretty sure he's um boy next door is like papa appa <laughs> um uh, I think he he's always like making you know like the real tiktok shorts with them and I'm pretty sure they call him pretty sure they call him appa like I feel like I, I saw a clip of that I wonder if it's probably it's probably good too. But yeah, okay, that was that was a fun collab. Not one that I expected, honestly. And I like how they were having fun in the music video too. Like they were um vibing together, like dancing together and stuff. I feel like you don't really see that often. You know, like everything's so everyone's so like touchy and very like sensitive to boys and girls dancing together. And just like sharing the same space, honestly. <laughs> um, but I really like it. That was so fun. It gave such like, like they they gave such like brother sister vibes. I feel like. Well, well, watch. Never mind. Like that. Yeah, I like that. Alrighty. I don't know if there's any other song I want to listen to. I think that might have been all of them. I don't I don't really know who else has come out with new music, honestly. Besides them. Yeah, so I think I think that might be it for for this. I'm trying to think of like other other artists that I know that might have come out with songs. I really can't think of any. So yeah, so I think that's going to be it for this video or these videos. I'm not sure if I'm going to. I might break this up into two parts actually. Um, just because I feel like it's really long. <laughs> it's, I think, I'm pretty sure there's like an hour footage, hour long footage here already. Oh yeah, it is. Oh my god, I can see the time actually. Yep, it's over an hour. <laughs> over an hour of footage. Okay, so, so yeah, I am most likely going to, um, cut this up into like two parts or maybe even three parts. I'm not sure. Um, but yeah, I hope you enjoyed listening k-pop with me on this little like k-pop catch-up um chill vlog that we did uh got to listen to a lot of new music and also got to check out some new artists which i don't often do i feel like i'm always really behind when it comes to checking out new artists and just new songs in general especially with k-pop I feel like it's just, you know, like, these groups just be coming out with albums just, like, month after month, or, like, every three months, it feels like, and it's just, it's crazy, honestly, and just keeping up with everyone is, is really hard, <laughs> but anyway, I'm so glad I got to finally listen to J-Hope's uh, new album, what is it called, I don't know what it's called, oh no, is it just on the street? Um, Hope on the Street, Volume 1. Also, it's a Volume 1. Does that mean we're going to get another volume? 
I don't know, I hope so. So yeah, so glad I got to listen to Hope on the Street finally. Glad I got to listen to TXT's Tomorrow finally. Also got to check out um new girl group and check out some new songs from New Jeans, Boy Next Door. And even Zico and Jenny's collab. So that was really fun. Um, I hope you enjoyed this video. I hope you enjoyed listening along and watching me do my little crochet project. Um, and yeah, uh, stay tuned again for more reactions, more videos. Hopefully, you know, soon um, me, Crick, and Croc would be able to get uh together again and film some more videos the the three of us um and yeah anyway so hope you liked the video uh like comment and subscribe and i will see you in the next one bye